Alright guys, so today I'm going to be going over this card trick that David Blaine performed on Ellen. I've gotten a few requests to go over it, so here's what basically it's going to look like. So I'm going to leave the description or the link in the description box so you guys can see what he did. Uh, but first off, let's say he had Ellen just shuffle the cards. So you can do this with the shuffle deck. And then he had her pick a card from the middle. And then he had her sign it. So in this case, let's say it was the seven of hearts. Now, all he did was he had uh, Ellen tell him where to stop. So he said stop here. She put the card in. And now what he does is really subtly, he just kind of dribbles the cards a little bit offset. So the whole thing here with this trick is that he it's just a little bit of card control. So he starts to dribble the cards a little bit out jog, as you can see. And what he does is he pulls up from that out jog and gets a thumb break like this. And obviously he's doing this a lot faster. I'm just showing you guys explanation. But he gets the thumb break and he double undercuts the cards to the top bringing uh, the spectator selection to the top position and from here he shows them the spectators that the cards not on top or not on the bottom and it's not on top and all he did was a double lift so I'll leave a link on the screen for that he just did a double lift the card is actually on top and then what he does is he says he can mix up the deck some more so he pulls the first card down bringing that card to the bottom continuing the shuffle and then since that card's on the bottom, all he does is overhand shuffle the cards until that card is back on top. So then from here, what he's going to do, and this move, I'm not, too, uh, I'm not too confident in a lot of the card tricks or the card maneuvers where um, a magician can uh, hold the deck and fold up the card, um, you know, under the guise of this, of this deck here. So essentially what he does, though, is he takes the spectator's card, which is on top, the deck is face up, and he folds up the card while misdirecting the spectator, so the card is going to be in fours. Okay, and that card is now going to be like this at the bottom of the deck underneath his right hand at this point. So he has the setup, and now if you guys watch the video, it'll make a lot more sense. Um, so essentially, he's holding the deck in this position, and the way the camera's angled, his left shoulder is kind of covering up most of what's going on. So if you guys, like I said, watch the video, you'll understand. But he takes Ellen's hand, and what he does is he angles the deck a little bit towards her. So when he can pick up the deck, and her hands are open, he wants to switch the grip of the decks with his left hand. He angles the deck towards her, so her line of sight is blocked from this card. He angles it towards her. He puts his right hand with the card underneath her hand, and she's not going to see this because now her hand is covering this up. The deck goes on top, and now he just slides the four-card packet underneath her watch and obviously he does this a lot uh, better than I do but essentially he's just putting it underneath the watch he puts the deck on top and now he sticks this card like I said under her watch she's holding this deck with both of her hands and then uh, from there what he does is just have the spectator call out 13 cards but obviously the card is under her watch the whole time so uh, what I would suggest doing guys is because that is a lot too difficult a lot of times for um, um, beginners and even myself I don't really mess with these kind of tricks too much but you can use the basic premise of what I showed you of kind of controlling the cards and you can kind of put that into your own effect uh, but like I said I just went over this because I've seen a few requests ask me to go over uh, this card trick and that's basically how he does it I hope this video works out for you guys and maybe you guys can come up uh, with some of your own tricks using these methods and as always guys I hope you guys like the video and thanks for watching